In case you didn't know, today is International Cat Day. I did not know that. Now and you do. Now I know and <laughs> you know as well. You know, sometimes that cat nap seems to just hit the spot regardless of the weather outside. Evening Edition's Austin Polly takes us to Anderson County for tonight's Positively LEX 18. A lost cat and where he goes when he's lost. Seems like there's a national or international day of something every single day. Well, you guessed it. Today is for the cats, the ones who like to cause trouble and even those who prefer a little bit of a cat nap. Before we opened, we knew that we wanted to um, have community outreach um, programs, so uh, the kids reading hour is something that we really, really wanted to do to connect the kids and the cats together. Becca Dyer Bayless has been a part of the Bourbon Tales Cat Cafe since the beginning. This was part of their mission, curious kiddos getting to hang out with these kittens. We're hoping that we will continue to grow and spread the word and we'll have more support to continue what we're doing already. Thanks to the library, which is just down the street, kids got to enjoy a story while playing with these kittens. We have been extremely blessed by our community so far, so this is just something we want to offer to them to give back. And they hope to have more events like this down the road. It's all as a way for the cafe to be immersed in the community and giving back to those who have given so much to them. It's amazing. Um, it has made all of this work uh, worth it. Um, it's been a lot um, to put into this, uh, a lot of long days, um, many long months. By the end of the week, 16 cats will have been adopted since the cafe opened back in June. In Anderson County, Austin Pollock, Evening Edition. What a perfect idea. Uh, you knew that was coming. Yeah, I knew it was coming. Well, we love telling positive stories happening in our communities. She just couldn't resist. If I you have an idea, we uh, hope that you <laughs> can't resist sending us an email and telling us about it. Uh, positively, <laughs> lex18 at wlex.tv.